Imagine if the internet was like this when Metal Gear Solid 2 came out. Because it would have <laughs> oh, been just as bad. Oh, no. And they would have got just as many death threats. So they'd be yeah. like, who the... Who Who's the hell riding? is riding? Who's riding? riding. Yeah. Who is riding? Spoiler, <laughs> yeah. if you didn't play it. And I love it. And I liked it a lot. I enjoyed it too. Yeah. <laughs> but people wanted to be Solid Snake. And they gashed you because they put it. This was even worse. They came out with a demo where you were Solid Snake the whole time. That's kind of And the second though. the demo is over, That's pretty you're misleading. a new character. So if you bought the game based on the demo, <laughs> you are a totally different character for the rest of the you game. You got to be careful. Bad news, good news. It's all good. It's all news. Yes. All right. Now for this news. The Last of Us 2 developer condemns online harassment of people who worked on the game. So this news we got from Kotaku. Um, All right. So I'm going to read them verbatim. So you can love or hate the game or share your thoughts about it. Drunkman. Drunkman? Drunk, Druckman. Drunkman. <laughs> Drunkman. <laughs> you talking about us? Drunk. You talking about me? <laughs> Druckman wrote on Twitter, so he works for them, of course. Uh, unfortunately, too many of the messages I've been getting are vile, hateful, and violent because people are assholes online. Online. Online, Online, yes, never to your face. Not in your face, no. But it said, based on the screenshot shared, the messages contain homophobic, transphobic, anti-Semitic, anti-Semitic, uh, and other hateful remarks. So... Mm. And I'm not going to read what it actually said. It was just, we wish death on whoever made that's this. Ridic- and, and it's, it's ridiculous. Wow, that's <laughs> I'm not going to read it verbatim because, game. you know, <laughs> basically they wish that COVID killed them. Wow. And wow. I was like, you that's know, a little too harsh. Wow. You know, wow. You know, you know what the problem is with, is with this generation? No consequences. They they're think they can they're say too anything. used to talking so much shit and not getting punched in the face for it. Yep. Yeah, no, that's true. Because they can hide. Yeah. Yeah. They can hide behind a computer. Just say <laughs> yeah. whatever they want. Yeah, because no, normally when you say something... Like you that smack somebody's face, you get slapped, you get, you get, slapped, beat, you get punched, you get thrown in a garbage can, <laughs> thrown in a locker. Yeah, exactly. Like, what's wrong with people? Yeah, people yeah, think I it's normal, know. but to keep going, uh, the last was part to develop a Naughty Dog put up a statement over the weekend condemning harassment and threats made against those who worked on the game, as director Neil Druckmann and others shared some of the vile messages they've been receiving. So, uh, I said, although we welcome critical discussion, we condemn any form of harassment, threats directed towards our team and cast and he said their safety is a top priority but we must all work together to root out this type of behavior and maintain a constructive and compassionate discourse so like i said uh, and they said direct things to people but we're not talking spoilers for the the yeah of course so i'm not going to go into everything they had problems with but basically it's like a feminist thing and people having a problem with how they they focused on women in the game like come on and and certain things about certain characters and I'm like people so, let people tell their story and let them tell the story they want to tell like stop being entitled like Mass Effect 3 was the first game that I remember that the internet totally like said I think this should be what you should have done and you know for what it was worth they did come out with downloadable endings to change right. the ones that they made Right. Because they felt that the community said that it was wrong that they did it the way that they nah, did. Nah, screw that. Screw so that, that screw made, that. in essence, the whole internet feel like they had the power to change stuff. Same with the Sonic thing. Mm-hmm. But it felt like, okay, I said it was wrong, so now you changed it. And now everyone feels like they have the power to change something yeah, that they don't is, like. But this, this is stories that people are telling. Yeah, that's, that's And also, this is death threats and freaking... Yeah, like, come on, man. man. Like, Listen, Game of Thrones, a, a difference Game of Thrones, between, same thing. There's a difference between <sighs> critiquing something yeah. and then death threats. Yeah, because they, yeah. 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 they think that's going to make it happen. Listen, they think if, that you they, if you don't like something, that's fine. You can have an opinion. You cannot. You don't have to like something. You can have a petition, you can voice apparently, because there's petitions for everything. But of course you, there is. But yeah. when you make a direct attack, that's uh-huh. that's where it's like no, that's, no, that's, that's never acceptable. Especially when it comes to making games, like there's so yes. many creative minds when it comes to creating a video game, a story, mm-hmm. a narrative, and for something like Last of Us, that is 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 geared towards to get you in. That game, it's like, a different type you, of experience. It, it, it's it's it, a yeah, different experience. You play, you they pl- work uh, uh, game developing. You know, they work on games for years. It's yeah, not, yeah. It's, it's not like a movie where they do it a couple vision. of months. It's their vision. It's their it. creative mind. It's their vision. Right. If you don't agree with something that goes on in the game, don't play it. Don't play right. the game. It's not. It's just not your right. thing. You know, yeah. it, it is the way it is. Same thing with TV shows. Mm-hmm. Game of Thrones. You know, always would kill off your favorite character, or there's do this or do that, and you're not a fan of it. Make the final season again. Yeah, it's like no, you don't. 
don't you do not have that. And the funny thing is, like, you know, I talk about it on the podcast a few mm. times. You know, like I draw my comic or whatever. Hey. You know, when I have spare time, I'd be damned if someone tells me what to do <laughs> with a character of mine just because they didn't like what happened to. It. You know, mm-hmm. kiss my ass. <laughs> like, you kidding me? You give me a, a death threat because of it? That's crazy. But the second somebody so. caved in, though. It's like, the, oh, we can do it. Now we can do we it. We can do it. However, now. and you know what the thing is? And it's messed up, too, because I was happy they changed it, but it's not good for the cultures when the they change Sonic. Sonic. The Sonic yeah. movie, yes. <laughs> yes. It's like... I mean, that was overwhelming, though, and it, it wasn't always negative. It was like, you messed up, really, and you didn't come out with that yet. Yeah, if they like, came out with that movie and they, they said, make get, the movie over, yeah. that's different. It well, was yeah, a trailer. I, yeah. They also didn't get death threats. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they probably did. <laughs> well, they probably it's like, did. Not an overwhelming... Yeah. I'm sure they didn't get like an overwhelming... Where they, that like, we saw. For I'm something like Sonic the Hedgehog, you got... like If you take if you make a movie and you do a you know a video game... Ba- you know, like based off of you yeah. know a movie based off a video game, you got to come correct. But well, we were used to on bad, but that was real bad. No, no, it, was real. It, it looked like me as Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes, yeah. like you well, can't you can't no, make Sonic a, look like that. Me. Was one of those things where it's like a, it was unanimous where everybody, yes, it's everybody, like, no, everybody it's, was it's like, a bad idea. It's yeah, a bad idea. Not, no it's one cool. liked it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, yeah. And, and the change they made. Oh my god, great, perfect, beautiful, yeah. great job. And the, I like the movie. It's dope. Yeah. Imagine if the internet was like this when Metal Gear Solid Two came out. <laughs> Because it would have oh, been oh, just oh, as bad, oh, no. and they would have got just as many death threats. So they'd be yeah. like, "Who the, who Who's the hell riding? is riding? Who's riding? Yeah. Who is right?" Spoiler: <laughs> yeah. If you didn't play it, and I love it, and I liked it a lot. I enjoyed it. Yeah. <laughs> but people wanted to be Solid Snake, and they gashed you because they put it. This was even worse. They came out with a demo where you were Solid Snake the whole time. That's kind of and the second enough. the demo is over, that's pretty. You're a new character. So if you bought the game based on the demo, <laughs> you are a totally different character for the rest of the you gotta game. Gotta be careful. Yeah, that would have gotten. So much hate. He's not even playable after he beat it either. No, it's just like, no, no he's just, he's just out of he's the He's in game. the at the very beginning. That very, was very awesome. beginning. He was in the demo. Yeah, that was, that awesome. was the demo. demo. And then <laughs> That was an awesome demo though. No, it was. But but that was it. When you played the game, you're like, What who is this guy? Wait, why is he have, wait, da- what? Who's he dating? Why does he have problems? Yeah. <laughs> why is his girlfriend why's, harassing him the entire he time yeah. while he's in danger? <laughs> Stop calling me. I'm trying to kill him. Remember that time in the no. Yeah, it was a lot of stuff. But so as a developer, you know, what do you think of this type of harassment? And have you uh, oh, it's, felt any of it? It's horrible. <laughs> it's, it's, no, of course not. I have not <laughs> harassed anyone. <laughs> uh, it, it's pretty crazy. I, I get that, that, like, culture pieces, pop culture, like movies and, mm-hmm. and, and video games, people get really passionate about it. Mm-hmm. But sometimes they completely lose reason. And then most of the time, these death threats and these harassment, they they specifically come from a group of people that's very toxic in in gaming, who feel very entitled and are they're scared little kids inside of them. They're they're scared that they're they're um, they 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 grow they they grew up thinking that gaming was their thing. It's it's my thing. Everyone has other things, but gaming is, is my thing, and they feel like, oh no, other people are are getting interested in games, and it, and it it's shuffling around the narrative. Is it's not always the same story of of a white dude and that chick, and he saved the chick, and they live happily ever after. It's because gamers have have diversified, and it's a awesome thing yeah. and that that these harassment they always come out from the, these groups of people and it really sucks because it, it comes from enormous insecurities they have deep inside of them and they, they, they fear like gaming is under attack yeah, yeah. Uh, gaming yeah, yeah. is being assaulted by different narratives and and if you're for example if you want to have a character that's in your story you, you even if you're not uh, uh, LGBTQ, and you want to have a, a character that's queer in your game, just because well, why not? Mm-hmm. And if you do that, you're gonna have people thinking that you made that on purpose to be like political, yep. and and yeah. you mm-hmm. did that to yeah. have your token queer character. No, I just I just just did it. And, and what's the harm? Right. So and always it always comes from the worst kind of people. Mm-hmm. So uh, very luckily, I've never have had to deal with these things um but also i've never really worked on controversial games mm. uh with a lot of narratives i really hope that it never happens uh to me and i really hope that in general in the industry it's gonna 
slowly go away uh, as as that that group that the group I mentioned mm -hmm. ends up getting old and maybe one day disappearing and then you will have an uh, usually younger people unless they've been like uh, educated by YouTube mm -hmm. uh, younger people are usually more acceptant of uh, of of uh, diversified gamers and uh, people coming from all kinds of backgrounds so i am awful for the future but we still have to power through mm -hmm. these these times of of the game industry adapting to diversifying uh, gamers but uh, like the the core gamers not being a pe happy about it <laughs> yeah gaming so, is gonna have <laughs> gaming is on an evolution yeah. and Seems like people are devolving <laughs> as yep. it's happening. Yeah. Well, the thing is, <laughs> also, yeah, also, uh, you know, not to continue, but like, you know, the games that we grew up with, right, mm -hmm. and, and that have like a really intense storyline or whatever, when something really significant happens, it's, it's not, you know, especially if it's like the graphics are like very cartoony, it's not, you know, you'll remember a certain thing that happened like, oh, damn. But they I, were different. I lost it. Yeah, it was a different feeling. But like when you have something like Last of Us that looks so real, mm -hmm. these these people who are playing it, like, like especially, real people yeah, yeah, too. it's like real people. So it hits mm -hmm. them so so hard they don't know how to deal with it you no, know they're, especially they're, if you're little yeah like if they're like 14 15 years old playing last of us it's like these are like real people i'm controlling and it's it's not like me playing fantasy star 2 rated m for mm. mature yeah you know what i'm saying like <laughs> fantasy star 2 or fantasy star 4 when you lose you know a character or something like that or something big happens well, or you still got hit by it yeah yeah, yeah no, no so you imagine get, now. yeah yeah that's what i'm saying it's like yeah i, I still remember fantasy uh, star 4 and 2 and you know the big moments that happen in, in those mm -hmm. games, and, and fa uh, Final Fantasy three, which is Final imagine Fantasy how VI. life changing that would be now. Yeah, it's like <laughs> I, it's like it's just thrown, you know, it's right there. And it's but just when like, you played that though, did you think that you had even the slightest bit of power that to the, let the creator know how you felt? Not for a hint. I actually, the funny thing is, um, spoiler alert for anyone who never played Fantasy Star two for the Sega Genesis. Okay, I'm just gonna throw that out there. Don't say the character though. Okay, there was a character. <laughs> there was a character that that was one of your main characters and and dies in the game, and you're like, oh, I can get her back later. I can get yeah, her back later. Thought, yeah. And you're like three lives, three lives. Uh, it's like, <laughs> oh, 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 wait, that character's not coming back. Oh, damn. Okay. But that was a slight yeah, yeah, change and, in storytelling. Yeah, though. it's it's like night because if everything's the same, how boring is that? Mm -hmm. You know, like if everyone if everything right. is happy. You know, and, then, but then now they have the now they can tell you that type of you know that style of game. Like and, they can and, say this is bad, yeah, and this is what's happening. And well, if you think, that, I'm sorry, I'll I'm go sorry. Ahead. Well, I was, I was going to yeah. say real quick yeah. is that the, the key to creativity is just taking risks and trying freedom to, to try yeah, stuff different, new, different, trying new things. Yeah, it's not going to work sometimes. There is but though. You got to try something new. There is a thing that they're doing in like Hollywood or on television where you can almost see. Like this demographic and this demographic and this demographic. Like they put characters in these shows I'm watching. I'm like, to force, all right, to I know you just forced this to in To force here. it, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want yep. that to happen in the game yeah, for the yeah. most part. Like well, I understand uh, diversity is fine. But if I see in every game these this demographic is hit it, like on this part. Okay, this is that character. Okay, this is that character. All right, you're yeah, doing you it You don't now. want token character yeah, no exactly. no and you just start seeing it, it everywhere it I'm just like, okay, ruins everything about i it. guess yeah, this it is who i'm supposed to be <laughs> yeah. on, on yeah. one on one half you want you want your stories to feel accessible because you know like as a kid growing up like yeah. all my favorite superheroes were white because there were no really black superheroes <laughs> <laughs> no you'd like to have somebody you can look exactly. up exactly yeah. yeah. and you can look and be like oh i I could be that. Mm -hmm. I, I could be that guy. I like Luke you know? Cage. Exactly. But I'm okay. I'm okay <laughs> yeah. with I'm okay Miles with Miles Superman Rose. being white though. Like mm. he doesn't have to be black for yeah. me to Agreed. like look right. up to Superman. Like yeah. and I don't look up to Superman by the way. But <laughs> but, <laughs> but I mean he can be the character. Yeah, he doesn't yeah, have yeah. to be me yeah. to, for me to care and like it. So yeah, you yeah. don't have to always change See, like Iron Man. My Change them to a girl because girls need a character to look up to. You can always make a new character that's, that's not Iron Man yeah. and make that character a female. I was going to say Don't that. take every big character and change them. Yeah, you don't have to do that. You don't have yeah, to take to an that. iconic character that's been tried and true. And everybody it only worked for Spider Man. <laughs> it only worked for Spider Man. It, even still, it was. But still, he still was, wasn't Peter Parker. It wasn't no. Peter yeah, Parker. It was a, it's that a, was a new, different. Yeah, it was a new. He's a new guy. Yeah, it worked for Thor too. Ah, As an alien, female Thor. No, when <laughs> um, a bunch female of Thor. When Jane Foster got got the hammer, people it, they, people they liked enjoyed it. that, mm. and I people still love Spider Gwen. People's, no, that, like I said, variety yeah. is fine, but don't yeah. take away what someone else's hero was. Yeah, don't <laughs> change the original. Fair enough. 
Don't change the original. Yeah. Because <laughs> somebody else looked up it. to that character. Yeah. It's you like, know what else? No. It, it, was, um, it was a bad movie, too, but it, uh, Fantastic the f- Four. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the Phantom? Uh, God. So oh, when they just changed Oh, them. God. <laughs> <laughs> the Phantom. Yes, there's also another one. Uh, Fantastic Four. They made uh, Michael B. Jordan as the Human, Human Torch. Torch. It yeah. just, that and looked it like, like a crowbar shoehorn type thing, though. And, like, I gave it a shot because I'm like, <laughs> all right, you know, they kind of, sh- but it, it, yeah, they shoot it, they shoehorned it in because they were like, we need to get this demographic and we got to, you know, appeal to these people. Like, <laughs> Not no, for man. nothing. That, the, sorry, I know it's a sidebar, but the issue with that movie was the, the script. No, it was bad. No, 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 it was a bad movie. Listen, like, it, it was a, a great, great was, movie. It was, it was a great so actor. Much, there was so much talent in that entire cast. There was. And, and that trailer was fire. That trailer was there fire. Was. And Nobody that trailer was problem. crazy Half good. of the stuff you saw in the trailer wasn't in <laughs> was the movie. The, movie. <laughs> <laughs> the majority of the trailer was not in the movie. That's But the initial thing was like, why? Yeah. Why did you change him? But, you know, he's a great actor and put the best actor in the part. I'm fine with that. Yeah, here's the thing. Though. We all we all have our opinions and we just voiced it right mm-hmm. on, on what how we feel about all this stuff, but we didn't do one not once did anybody do like a death threat. No, <laughs> or it's no, like, you can not like okay. something and you just don't do it. Don't exactly. don't support it. Exactly. If you don't like it, don't support it. I have more of an issue with people who think LeBron's better than Michael Jordan. All right, but wow. I'm I'm be giving people death threats. Wow. I'm just like you're just stupid wow. and don't know basketball. I saw you <laughs> sending <laughs> emails, <laughs> but wow. that's the thing. Send them death threats. Send Twitter, them death threats. Twitter is a big problem. For this, though, I yeah, think yeah. that Twitter is yeah. more of a problem than anything. Too Twitter's many toxic people. Too many the, toxic people. The fact people. that people take Twitter so serious, like yeah. people need to say, "Who cares?" I don't care what that guy said. People need to just start saying, "I don't care." Or if they say something very toxic and like threatening, care. their address has to go with the tweet. Well, that's what they tried. <laughs> well, listen, yeah. They tried to do that on YouTube by putting your real name on, and that yeah. didn't work out because uh, oh, people couldn't type what they wanted. Anymore. It's like, let me go talk to you face to face, and let's see you no, say that to me. But know? I think people take what people say to the limit, and like you know, start taking things with a grain of salt, and say, listen, that's not important. Your Twitter is not important, and then mm. people will be like, oh, what am I? Why am I even writing you then? Yeah, because people put too much into it. Mm. Oh, he, I can't believe he said that eight years ago. I can't believe <laughs> yeah. he said that today. Like it's crazy. Uh, it's too much stock in a sentence. Yeah. Make it like take the power away from it. Relax and, and have a good. beer. Relax and, the world, and have a beer. The world will be a better place. Yeah. How do you fix this, man? <laughs> but, but yeah, that's. Yeah. I mean, not to go off on any other news, but that, that's the harassment. It's online harassment, man. It's, it's a not. Big, it's, it's a big nonsense. deal. It's, it's changing the world it's, and it's, it's making the world deal. suck. Yeah. It's a huge deal. It's and, new. And, if um, kids are learning to think that this is normal, this is the yeah. thing. It's not going to no, go it's like, away. No, it's, this is not the thing to do. Yeah. So, like, uh, Laurent, how do you protect your kids from online harassment? Well, I, I'm I'm still I'm still far from that because my my eldest daughter is five year old, oh, okay. so she Perfect. doesn't have she, doesn't uh, have she can't write. <laughs> so no, no, I'm not I'm not too big on that. So we don't Go. own uh, a tablet. Mm. Uh, we each are my girlfriend and I. We have our phones, and then we have a uh, hard Nintendo Switch. Mm. But they that that's it, and they they're still not at the age that they they can write. So, okay, I'm not there yet, but I really hope that I'm gonna be raising kids that do not do these things mm-hmm. because they don't wanna they don't wanna be mean. To, to up to now, they have almost never been mean. Mm. Uh, when they're angry at something, it's because of of some sort of injustice that they perceive, but it's not to to hurt someone else. Mm. Because clearly, when people are going into uh, online harassment, and they, they want to feel like they've actually hurt someone. Yeah. They want to feel yeah. like, yeah. oh, this, I'm gonna say this, and it's gonna be really hurtful, yeah. and it's gonna be making me weirdly feel better about being hurtful. Power. So, mm-hmm. um, yeah, I, I guess there, there, there's some kind of mental illness mm. uh, that has to be uh, related to that Absolutely. because it's wrong. Definitely. Well, wanting people to be hurt, it's just so wrong. Yeah. So I, I guess there. There must be something wrong in their life. The yeah. illness is uh, having definitely. a thousand people tweet, and it make the internet makes that seem like the world. It yeah. amplifies. A thousand it. people are not eighty million people. Well, they, <laughs> like these people they make yeah. it seem oh, like two people can be. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe what the world is saying. They show you two tweets. And yeah. I'm like, wait, that's not what the world is saying. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's two dudes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a toxic community <laughs> who jumps out a hundred people. Sounds like a million people. And they're a minority. And that's what the them. internet makes it seem like. Yeah. And they could be the same group of like people who come in everywhere. Everywhere. And they get the power. Like, oh, look at what we did. We made the headlines. <laughs> we made the headlines. Look at this. Well, these people don't like themselves. They hate themselves. It's not even the people that they're attacking. They don't like themselves at the all. The only way to get rid yeah. of them is to annoy no. them. Man. 
course. Yeah. It, and it's it's not only I, I hear you uh, and, and it makes sense that you're talking about Twitter, but it's just not it's not just Twitter. No, it's all, it's, no dude. It's all when these social, mobs, media. Yeah. social media. Yeah, social media. Social media. When these mobs are wild at something, and and we were talking Last of Us, and yeah. Last of Us. Uh, got hurt on Metacritic mm-hmm. as well. Those are oh, people, and yeah. uh, you could bombing. you could really see the difference between yeah. uh, what the, the professional mm-hmm. game critics thought of the game, right. and then what that internet mob yes. uh, thought of that game. And they changed and that. They haven't they even changed played the way the they do it now. I can't wait to finish the game because yeah. I want to do and a video a, talk about they're it. They're changing the way they take reviews in a, in a way that's actually yeah, good because yeah, th- th- for that exact. Example is like they're yeah. actually relooking how they they're uh, doing their Metacritic. Because review bombing is every every way you can be faceless is where the problem lies. Yep. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And and I think uh, on another extent because I I work in games and uh, all all gaming platforms have their review system. Mm. Uh, I, I understand how they can be useful to users, yeah. but I hate them so much, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. so much yeah. with power. with a with a passion. Yeah. I've read. Any kinds. I, I've worked in mobile in the past, so mm-hmm. I've read uh, reviews that were one star, and the comment was "great game." <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know, what? you didn't understand the star system, or just <laughs> yeah. I don't know, or or five, or it, sometimes I, there were four stars, and it was amazing game. I recommend it to my friend, and blah blah. Then why four star? Then the, the, these four five star systems uh, that users can anyone can rate is is. Uh, Horrible.